Towards the end of 2019 and into early 2020, the bright orange star Betelgeuse, or Betelgeuse, in the constellation Orion grew markedly dimmer. Just looking with your eyes alone, you could see it darken from week to week. Betelgeuse is a red supergiant, 15 to 20 times as massive as the Sun, the sort of star that will eventually explode as a supernova. Stars like Betelgeuse routinely vary quite a bit in brightness. It's what's called a semi-regular variable, and it goes through a roughly 400-day cycle of fading and brightening, but the dramatic dimming that started at the end of 2019 was unprecedented and it got people speculating, not unreasonably, that perhaps Betelgeuse was about to blow up. A team of astronomers has now published the results of their study of what probably happened to cause the sudden drop in brightness. They analysed images collected by the European Southern Observatory's Very Large Telescope in Chile, an instrument powerful enough to show details on the surface of Betelgeuse. What seems to have happened, say the astronomers, is that a large cool spot developed on the star's surface. This isn't unusual for red supergiants because they have huge convective cells that give rise to both hotter and cooler regions on the surface. Red supergiants also shed a lot of material into their surroundings through powerful stellar winds. When the big cool spot formed, the researchers believe, it led to a drop in temperature further out from the star that caused previously ejected gas to condense into dust. The dust then absorbed much of the star's light, leading to a further major drop in the star's brightness as seen from Earth. This event doesn't mean that Betelgeuse is going to explode anytime soon. It'll probably experience many more such episodes before finally going supernova, tens or hundreds of thousands of years from now. Of course, when it does explode, it'll be spectacular. Betelgeuse lies at the relatively close distance of 550 light years, so that when it blows up, it'll be visible for several weeks during the day and be perhaps as bright as the full moon before fading permanently into obscurity.